Hello to all my fannies out there. This is Fanny. Um, today we're going to talk about cooking a corned beef and cabbage brisket. Um, St. Patty's Day just passed. I'm not Irish. I'm barely Scottish, so I don't really care. I just like it. Um, so what I've done here, I've got my brisket. I got it from Tops, because you know I love that. Um, it's going to go in my big pot. This is my big, big, Ooh. big pot. Um, you might call it a stock pot or a sauce pot, whatever you want to call it. Uh, what I've done is I've cut the brisket out of that bag of grossness. It's like utter slime in there. Nasty. Don't put that in your pot unless you want slime and what looks like mucus. No. So I've taken that out of the bag. I rinsed the bag so my bin doesn't smell like throw up. Um, then I've rinsed it off because it was rather slimy and I wanted to be able to hold it so it didn't fall on the floor. And then I've stuck it in my pot. This is my brisket in the pot. And those little, uh, I don't Seeds. know what you call them. They look like balls of nonsense. It's a seed packet. You stick it in there. They said you don't need to because it's already pre-seasoned. Whatever. Stop. I stuck it in there anyway. So I'm going to cover that with some water, bring it to a boil. It says about 50 <coughs> minutes for every pound. This is uh, just over four pounds. So we're going to cook it for eh, three and a half hours or so. That's about 4.30 now, but you see we eat late anyway, so time is not of the essence. Once that's done, or roundabout done, I'm going to take my cabbage. I really like cabbage. I don't so much like the brisket. It smells like old dirty socks and sweaty armpits. If that's a Irish meal, thank God I'm not Irish. Uh, so I'm going to put lots and lots and lots of cabbage in there. I've got two heads in the fridge. I think it's about seven, seven pounds of cabbage. I don't know. Really care. So I'm going to cut that all up, put that in there, let it boil with the brisket, get some nice flavor going. Then I'm going to uh, put my carrots. I've got some frozen carrots in my freezer because I didn't get any fresh. And I'll stick those in there. I don't have any potatoes because I've already used those for my ham dinner that I had a few days ago. So it'll be corned beef, cabbage, and carrots. And when that's done, well, we're gonna eat it. So, uh, not much of a cooking video, just basically what I'm cooking. I don't really know how hard it is to cook corned beef cabbage, you just cook it. And then when it's done, you eat it. So, uh, right off your pop. Uh, this is my, my lad, Michael. Sometimes we call him Boogie. Boogie? <laughs> See, when he was a little baby, he had boogers all on his face, oh. constantly wiping, sleeving it on his sleeve, and just putting it all over I his don't clothes. Have any Thank God, that's done. That's where he got the nickname from. Uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, maybe I'll post a picture in the comments when I'm done. If I can even do that, I'm new to the YouTube. Just so. Uh, <laughs> Happy St. Patty's Day late from a semi-Scottish and uh, I don't like cheers. Days.